Hi, this is Charlie Montefiello with Blue Bear Flutes. Uh, of course, uh, as always, you can find us on Instagram, Facebook, uh, Twitter once in a while, and our website, bluebearflutes.com. The point of today's video is to show you that you can make something amazing out of something that may not seem as amazing. So behind me, you actually see some of my firewood. Uh, we had bought a whole bunch of uh, pallets and, and uh, tuba sixes and things that were just kind of like bad and we use them for firewood during the winter time in our workshop. And um, in addition to the scraps and everything else we have left over from all of that, it actually burns pretty nice. Once in a while, when I'm cutting down or breaking down a pallet, I think to myself, that sure is some beautiful wood. Uh, what many of you may not know is a lot of the pallets that are used to haul heavy items, uh, anything from car parts to whatever, um, are made out of some beautiful, amazing woods. Everything from expensive curly maple and, and other maples to red oak here, which is not necessarily as preferable a wood to a lot of people, but I know back in the old days it really was. White oak is what you usually buy at most of your lumber yards these days to make things out of, but this red oak is something that you just can't find on the open market, or at least I haven't been able to find it as easily. So um, each time I broke one of these down, I thought, oh my goodness, I'm wasting some beautiful flutes. <laughs> and uh, I've got some pallets here behind me. A lot of them are made out of ash these days, um, just a number of different odd types of wood. And then some. sometimes the center bars and the pallets are made out of one and you know, the rest of it's made out of something else. And I thought, well, you know, what's a good gift idea type wood? Something that's unique and just really uh, amazing looking, which you guys can look at some of the close-ups on this guy here in a moment. But, uh, you know, I decided to make this this beautiful little flute. It's actually in the key of high B. It's made out of red oak, um, and I'm very pleased with it, both the sound quality and the look of it. The grain of oak, especially red oak, which is a lot easier for me to see, um, it almost looks like it's been printed with a with a printer uh, because you can see little dots in it, little grain inside of the wood, uh, other than the lines, which are more of the, the pores inside of the wood. Uh, but this dude's been finished out really nice. I'll play him for you. beautiful little flute made out of a piece of scrap wood um, and uh, one of many videos that we've made making flutes out of things that are just kind of off the wall and a little unique. Um, you'll get to see some more of those videos very soon. Many of them we've actually already recorded waiting for some of them to come out in the right order. So I hope you enjoy the video. Um, look forward to seeing the process of me making the flute. Those of you who are interested in making your own uh, this video is not so much a DIY as it is a proven concept, but we have hundreds of other videos on making Native American flutes. And as always, it's a good idea to subscribe, hit the bell icon so you can you know, keep up with everything that we do. And uh, like I said, find out how to make flutes out of just about anything. I uh, hope you enjoy the video.